Hey guys, um, so today I'm going to film a tutorial using the Maybelline Quad because everybody has been agreeing and raving about these so I'm just going to do a little bit of a how-to video how to make this eye chart on the back come to life. But before I get started, I forgot in my favorite foods video about these Vita Brownies. I just had one for breakfast and they are just so delicious. Only 100 um, calories per serving, which is one brownie, two grams of fat, 23 carbs, four grams of protein, six grams of fiber. There are all these different things. These are brownies, but there are vitamin tops, like muffin tops. So check these out. They're whole wheat and they are so good. You put them in the microwave, they like melt. Oh. Okay, so anyway, I'm just gonna start this um, and I'm gonna try to go as quickly as I can. <laughs> Okay, so you're going to start just by priming your lid. I'm going to use Lay in Low Paint Pot by MAC. It's just a nude with um, peachier undertones. I'm just using it because it's my favorite one. You can really use anything you like. Um, I just think that this opens up my eyes really well. It makes me look wide awake. So now we're going to get our Maybelline Quad, and I'm going to be using Charcoal Smokes, the four, number four. So, as it's labeled, we're going to put that to use. So I'm going to start with the lid color, which is this one, and I'm just going to take this MAC brush, but you can use any brush you want to lay on this color, um, and we're just going to lay it on so pigmented. Just going to pat it on. So because this is a lid color, we're just going to stick to our lid with this. Some of you are going to have bigger lid space than I am. Some smaller, so just work with what you have. And I'm going to pat a little bit more color down towards my lash line, just because it's sort of getting spread. We're going to do the same on the other eye. So there are our lids. Okay, and so next we're going to go for our crease color, which is this outer one. I'm going to take my 217 brush from MAC, but I really don't like it, so you can just use whatever you want. Um, so your crease is, see where your eye, you know, has a crease, literally? It's going to be right in there. So we are going to take this in there and a little bit above. So what I like to do to make sure I'm getting it in my crease is I open, I close my eye, and I stick my brush there, and then I open my eye. And then I do windshield wipers. Now, you should make sure that you're using a brush that is, um fitting to your size of your eye. This 217 brush is a little too big for my eye. I have pretty small eyes, so I am going, I am needing like a smaller crease brush that has more of a pointed tip, but for all of you girls with big eyes out there, you're very lucky. So just windshield wipers. I sort of like to give it a little bit more on the outside. And then we're just gonna take it on the other side. And just go in and kind of like perfect that. The only thing I will say about these quads is I feel like the lid and the crease color are a little bit too similar, but that's all right. Um, so now we're going to take the outer corner color, which is the um, black. And I'm just going to take this pencil brush from MAC because I have small eyes, but you can use like this type of brush or anything you want. So I'm just going to take this and I like to kind of just like trace that out like a line like right there, the outside. See like where it ends. I just kind of take a line and trace it up. 
And then at the upper point of it where it ends, I like to take it in. See that? So I'll do it on the other side. Okay, so see how that is? And then I will go back in and um, I'm going to spread it slash blend it. I'm just going to take my 217 and whoops, just blend it even more. Then I'm going to take the pencil brush again and I'm going to take the lid color and just like run it underneath. take the um, brow bone color which is this one this one and I'm going to take this brush from essence of beauty or something yeah just gonna dab it in there and run it on our eye our brow bone now brow bone is only underneath your eyebrow and what I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna Flip this around and take some more of that brow bone color and stick it in the um, tear duct area. Kind of bring it underneath to meet that black down there or the charcoal. What I'm do is take my um, just like shader brush and stick it in the brow bone color and mix it with the lid color and just stick it like kind of over that lid color again. Blending brush again and just make sure I've blended it all together. That there are no harsh lines. Eyes with um, feline coal power and I'm actually going to line my um, upper water line. And what that does is it'll like carry down to the bottom. So I really like this for that because it carries the color down. And if you only line on the um, outside of your upper water line, then it'll only take the color down to the outside of the bottom water line. So you're not like, for daytime or whatever, it's not like closing in your eyes. But then I will also um, line my upper lash. So I just added some full and soft mascara and I smudged in my eyeliner and I also took my pencil brush and just kind of made sure that this dark crease, this outer corner was over as far as I wanted it to go. So this is just how I use my Maybelline quad. There are many different ways. This isn't specifically a night look or a day look. It's just rate, comment, subscribe and thank you for watching.